Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create mass transition effect in Fimura 12. Okay, so you know that we have Fimura 12 with the raw mass or freehand mass, which is very useful to create mass transition. By the way, this is just one of many creative ways to use freehand mass. Alright, so here's an example. Alright, so this is my film trail and in order to create much transition effect, you need to film two shots. This is the first one, okay, so just run and drop it onto the timeline. And for the first one, you have to move camera and there should be something across the frame. In my case, I use this microphone, okay, but you can use any subject. Okay, so for example, we can play. very nice right we can start from here okay starting from here so i'm going to split the clip and delete the beginning and i also mute the audio okay so when the camera finished the movement we can cut the clip right here because we are going to use this microphone okay so this is a clip and we are going to use this microphone as a cover or stuff like that. Okay, and the next shot is the clip that you want to transition from this clip to that. Okay, for example, I can use this one. By the way, I'm going to start my clip from here. So I'm going to set an in point for it. I'm going to press I to set an in point. And we need to put this clip on the timeline also. And we need to move the first clip to one track above it. And then we can start masking the first clip. Okay. So we can start from here when we see the microphone. Okay. When we don't see the microphone. I'm sorry. Just move it from here. Just Okay. So this is the first spot. Alright, and the next thing, you want to straight out the timeline, okay? And then, you want to double click here at the video. And then, you want to select video and select mask. And now, you can select this draw mask to draw a mask around the frame. By the way, I'm going to set the zoom level to about 25% so that I can draw a mask outside of the frame. Okay, just right click here and select zoom level and then select 25 percent now we can click here at the draw mask just click here and then we want to draw a mask here around the frame okay so this is our first mask just click here and then we need to enable the keyframe for the raw mask just click here to enable keyframe and the next option you want to do is to increase the blur strength okay so maybe 10 or something like that okay so this is our first mask and now we need to move the playhead to the position where the microphone cover the frame okay so we want to move the playhead about something like this until okay so at this position okay so at this position we need to adjust the mask now all you need to do is to double click here or select here at the preview window and then you want to click here and adjust the mask just move it okay and we want to go one frame forward just use this option forward one frame and then you want to click here and move the mask okay so just move it and then you want to click here and then we want to move the mask so just keep doing until the mask go out of the frame okay another frame just do like this and move one frame forward just move the mask outside of the frame okay so we have multiple keyframe here just double click here and now at this keyframe okay so at this keyframe we want to put our, our next video under it so i'm going to put my clip here and also i will mute the audio 
Okay, so here's the match transition effect in Filmora Trail. Let's play it from the beginning and make it full screen. Okay, and replay. Alright, so this is how to create match transition effect in Filmora Trail. Hopefully this video is helpful for you. If you have any more questions, just let me know at the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.